Assalamu alaikum. In this video, I explain the relation of fetal membrane in monozygotic twin. What is monozygotic twin? This twin developed from single zygote. This is two cell stays. At this stage, when cells are separate and form two individual fetus, then this is known as the identical twin or monozygotic twin. Mono means one. This twin is developed from one zygote. And their sex are the same and their phenotype and genotype also same. If these two cells is separate in the early part of the development, they create two blastocyst cavity, two bilaminar germ discs, two amniotic cavity, two yolk sac cavity, and two separate coronate cavity. So, two placenta is developed, and there is a two separate amniotic cavity and two separate coronic cavity. You know the amniotic cavity is hugely enlarged, and yolk sac cavity is reduced in size. So what happened? The amniotic cavity is fused with the coronic cavity. So this type of pregnancy is known as the dicoronic, diamniotic twin pregnancy. Means there is a two amniotic cavity, two coronic cavity, two placenta. If the separation process is little bit later, then single blastocyst is formed, but there is two embryo blast. So what happened? The single coronic cavity is developed, but there is a two bilaminar germ discs is formed, two separate amniotic cavity, two separate yolk sac cavity. So what happened? The amniotic two amniotic cavity is hugely enlarged and they fuse with the single coronic cavity and this type of pregnancy is the known as the diamniotic monocoronic twin pregnancy. So what happened here? Here a single placenta is developed and there is a two separate amniotic cavity which is fused with the single coronic cavity. If the separation process is start further later part of the development, then what happened? Single blastocyst is formed. There is a single tropoblast and there is a two bilaminar genes, uh, germ discs is formed from the embryo blast, but single amniotic cavity and single yolk sac cavity and obviously single coronic cavity. So what happened? The amniotic cavity is hugely enlarged and is fused with the coronic cavity and yolk sac cavity is reduced. So this type of pregnancy what happened? The single amniotic cavity is fused with the coronic cavity and single placenta is developed. So this type of pregnancy is known as the monocoronic monoamniotic twin pregnancy. So there is a three fate of the monozygotic twin. Twin arise from single zygote. If development uh, separation is the early part, then it create two placenta, two amniotic cavity, two coronic cavity. If the later part of the development is separate, it create one placenta, one coronic cavity, two amniotic cavity. It is separate in the further uh, part of the development, then it is the most delayed separation. So here the single placenta is formed, single coronic cavity and single amniotic cavity. So diamniotic, dicoronic, twin pregnancy, monocoronic, diamniotic twin pregnancy, monocoronic, monoamniotic twin pregnancy.
this is the T uh, type of twin pregnancy seen in monozygotic twin. So this is all about explanation of the to this figure. If you like this video, please share this video and support my channel.